Hello everyone, I am Yash Patel and welcome to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to see order filtering. Okay. So to do that, first I will just go to the Django Raspberry website. Okay. And here, just click on API guide and filtering. Now here on the left side, you will just find ordering filter. Okay. Just click here and uh, here they are giving the example of implementing this ordering filter okay see why do we use this ordering filter sometimes the uh, that might be scenario that you want to order every data which is according to the latest update so let's say for example i have already uploaded the blog which was seven days ago and now currently i'm up uploading new blog okay so I don't want that block should be and should be under the seven days ago block older one, but instead I want that newer block should be updated on the first priority and older one at the last priority. So to order that type of data, we can use this ordering filter. So here in the example, you can see they have given username ascending, username descending, email ascending email descending etc okay but this might not be the case for you like if you implement ordering filter for another model then the fields might differ okay so here if you directly use this api in another framework okay then you can directly pass this ordering argument and equals to the field you want to order with okay so you can see they have also shown how you can pass multiple ordering filters okay so let's implement this one okay now now here as we have passed the django backend filter and filters.search filter we need to pass this ordering filter filters.ordering filter okay so i'll just copy this one come over here and paste that so yeah you can also pass multiple filters okay so no issues on that and after doing that you just need to pass this ordering fields so i'll just copy that one but let us see what if what if we don't pass this ordering field okay so i'll just you know i have implemented this filters dot ordering filter in blog list create view okay so let's see so i'll just Start the server. I have already activated the environment, so I'll just zoom a screen so you can view properly. Yeah, five minutes of the server. Okay, I'll open that one now. Here, if I go to filters and see, I got each and every field of the blog model why because in this class where's that class called yeah here in this class we are already passing the query set of blog and this is fetching all the data of the blog which means it is including all the fields right so that is why we are having this type of the fields i mean all the fields so if i click on this id descending then you can see it started from 4 to 1. Now, if I go ahead and filter out ascending, then you can see 1, 2, 4, like this. Okay, now here, let me show you one another thing. So, let's say you are not using this filter, but if you want to do ascending and descending, then you can directly just go over here and see. Currently, this is not containing minus sign, which means this is in asc ascending order. But if I write minus and press enter, then it will directly go into descending order. So if you use this API in the REST framework or on any other framework, then you can operate ordering filters, something like this. Okay. Now, let's specify the field. I don't want all the fields to be filtered out 
okay so i'll just go ahead and limit the fields so here now i can pass ordering filter sorry ordering fields i'll just copy this whole thing paste that one now i'll just remove this let's see on what fields we can order the data so i can just say post date post date then category category i'll just copy this one because we need to fetch category name indirectly so yeah. then i think this should be fine so i'll just save this come over here refresh come over here and you can see we got two fields okay so if i say category descending why it's not working category ascending yeah it is working it is working so in ascending order let's see the category 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 just category field yeah markdown m m then p yeah it is working and p okay so yeah this is working actually because after m it comes p for in abcd if you remember i know everyone knows abcd yeah okay so yeah this this is how ordering can be implemented and can be used so yeah this is it for today's video guys if you like my video please like share and subscribe to my channel and i will see you in the next one thank you